Hey everybody, Shane here from GimmeAct.com. Here we are today back in the new title update for Tony and Clyde going for the Let's Have a Sit Down achievement. This is to beat the first boss on easy difficulty. Make sure you set your difficulty on easy PC and then you can find the first boss on the first stage of Chapter 2. So make sure you load that up. It's going to be Sons of Subversion Part 1. Load it up and then our goal is to make it to the boss. It should be pretty easy as you can actually skip most of the enemies. Make sure you head to the left and then we're going to cut through the building right here. You're going to want to head for the hallways, which should be on your right. Make sure you take this lower path in. Take out these few enemies and then make your way to this part of the hallway where it starts going up. And then over here, you should get your first checkpoint. So feel free to die as you will respawn with your full health intact. Boss is going to be right here in this big open room right here. You're going to start the fight by shooting him. And then the basic strategy to defeat him is to just circle him around this forklift and this wooden crate and shoot him as he rounds the corner. You do want to be a little careful. If you do end up being too close to him, he's going to more likely than not change directions. And you want to basically also try to keep him as far away from you on the circle as best he can. And do take advantage of shooting him whenever he does round that corner. Once you start shooting him, he isn't going to shoot you, so do keep that in mind. You can kind of cheese him with this little timing spot right here, and you should be able to land massive damage as soon as he comes off the corner. Once you get him to at about half health, he's going to get a little speed boost indicated by this line of dialogue right here in the bottom right. As soon as that happens, you want to be very careful as he is going to close the distance way quicker. Try your best to keep him at the opposite end of the circle as you, but remember you do have your dodge roll to fall back on. So if he does start shooting you, make sure you quickly dodge roll straight up or straight down on either the left or the right of the circle. And you should be able to use that to increase your distance between you. While playing defensive, remember he is going to be most vulnerable coming out of that corner, so make sure you do take advantage. But don't be afraid to change directions if he's getting way too close, and take advantage of your dodge roll the best you can, as you are going to be invincible when you are in the middle of the dodging animation. Once you finally manage to take him out, you should be good for the clear, and the achievement that goes along with it, 100 gamer score for this one, and that's all there is to it.